Here we go, are you ready? Let's rock and roll. Welcome to Creations by Karen, and today we are going to make a Sarah flower. Sarah flower. Oh, so why, why is it called a Sarah? Uh, because the person that created the flower, her name was Sarah. Have you got one named after you? I say tarot flower. Yes, I do, actually. Uh, yeah. I don't see a flower. Well, you're going to make a flower, a yeah. petal. Thank you very much, Mary. Good morning. I love a beautiful day today. It's going to be sunny awesome. Ontario. Okay, so we're going to be using a small flower board, unique in the Greek, small flower board. And the first thing I'm going to do is put the hanger on it. And Anthony's going to be looking at the comments so I can get through this in a timely manner. Actually, um, yeah, so you're going to uh, load all these. And on this row, Hi, Sherry. Sorry. You, Hi, Sandy. you're going to use shared holes. Shared hole means he's going to put tie wraps in these ones and then put one in between here, right? You got that? Thumbs up, people, if you get this. You want to see them. All right. So, <clears throat> once again, small flower board. You've got one, two, three, four rows. You're going to put singles in these ones and then shared holes in number three. Okay? And just singles in all these other ones. Okay? Ready? All right, let's go. So, that's the flower board. And I've already gone ahead, of course, and loaded it all. And see, this is what I mean by the shared holes here. And if you look at the back, you could see how I've added the shared holes here. All right? But I'm going to put my hanger in first. Good morning, Beverly. And Anne. So all I do is come into the front and make a little loop, which is about an inch and a half or two inches. Come here. Twist it three times or so, and then fit it into the hole again, like this. We had a good day yesterday, didn't we? The market? Yeah, well, it was a good day. It was uh, obviously Mother's Day weekend, so quite a few shoppers here. There's some events going on, and then yeah. locally. Three. Okay, we're just going to cut this off using like aviation snips, like that. Alright. Good morning, Linda. Happy Mother's Day. I'm Lisa. Okay, so there's my beginning. Now, I'm going to show you the fold for the inside. So, this is just deco mesh and I ordered this from Unique in the Creek. It was a set of three, um, but you know, I'm going to use it for this. So I'm going to start with a light blue and a dark blue. Light blue I'm going to use first because I'm going to make the centerpiece for my flower, my rose. You know, I don't know how I feel about these roses, but I had an order for this. So I'm just going to make it. I'm going to wing it. What have I done with my uh, wing it, wing it. rubber bands? There we are. So here are my little Hi, Stacy. rubber Happy bands. Happy Mother's Day. So you just 10 by 10 cut with a wood burner. You don't need to do that. You don't need to cut it with a wood burner. I'm just so CD, so I do. Right? Take to the top to the bottom. And this is a good way to use 21 inch mesh because you can just cut it in half and use it, right? So, and I come about, oh, three inches or so. And just scrunch it up so it looks like a kind of an umbrella. And I cut this off. And then I put a little rubber band on it. Now, that's the way you're gonna make them all, but so you got this, right? But for the center one, got Good morning, one. Heather. Oops. Oh, sorry. There we go. I'm just going to take this and just roll it like this. So 
so it's just skinny like that and then take my rubber actually I'll just take this first I'm going to cut this part off and then take my rubber band thank you oh, for assistance. Yeah. and just rubber band it like that and then I'm just going to hot glue this make sure you don't hit the uh, rubber band to the board, the right at the center of the board. Now you don't have to do this, you, you don't, but you know, I just do because, you know, that's the way I roll. No blowing Heather. Kathy. Just take Hi, on. Hot glue. Generous amount. This is, a, this is a good thing to make on Mother's Day. Yeah. Just place it down in the center. And you want to just hold this for a minute. See all those flowers? We've got roses on the wall. Good morning, good morning, everyone. Good morning, Annette. Okay, so that's going to sit there nice and pretty. So then the first, uh, sorry, the third and the fourth row are going to be made like a flower, like a rose. And then these ones are going to be made with the D. Michael fold, okay? So, what I've done, gone ahead and done it. <clears throat> I've made a lot of these, right? And I've cut them all, prepared them all, but I'm doubling it, right, with the blue. See it? Oh. I'm going to double it because this is really fine match, yeah. and I want to make sure that it covers the board. So you just take this. Place it in your fourth row tie wrap. Hey, Jamie and Rosetta from Kentucky is in the house, lady. Kentucky's in the house. Okay, and I'm just going to snug it up. I'm facing, facing this way. I'm just going to clip this off. Now, what we're going to do. Hey, Barbara. Happy Mother's Day. Cleveland lady. Garbage can. Right. Closer. So, I'm just going to take this and just gently come around the inside one, right? Like that. Okay, so there's my first petal in. And then I just take a rubber band. You don't have to do this. I just do because it makes it a lot easier for me. And I just place a little rubber band around it and it stays in place. Ta-da. Magic. Magic. So then I'm going to take another one and I'm going to go across from this one. And I'm going to do the exact same thing, but I'm going to turn it so it'll have light blue. So I'm alternating light blue being at the front and this darker blue. So you just go ahead and put it in. Hi Crystal. How is Maryland today on this lovely Mother's Day? Snug it up. Get off. And then just come around the one you put on like so. Cool, eh? Mm. And then I just take a clip and clip that together. Take another one. I'm going with light blue because I'm alternating. And go here.
or your clip. Cut this off. Morning, Dion. And I'm going to go the same, Alan. Sometimes they get trapped underneath here. Yeah. That's okay, we'll fix it. I haven't, I haven't fingernails is a bonus. Yes. Yeah. yeah. That's very true. And we're going to go with light. Jamie has asked, the tails, are they insert, uh, inserted going out? I put them going out. Um, some people put them alternating in and out, but I'm putting them as um, coming out. It's just the way I do it. You can do this any way you want. You have a hard time doing the roses? They're my nemesis. Yeah. But I had an order for this, so I thought, okay, I'm going to charge her good money for this. It's not my favorite. No. But I had one here yesterday, and I sold it, and she said, I'd like to have a blue one. All right. I can do that. Just come around. After that, I have my fourth row all done with the pedal. Take this off, and I just take another rubber band, and I just go around all of them. Oh. Jamie says that you do them so beautifully. Mm, thanks, Jamie. Mm -hmm. I've got this in my pocket. <laughs> All right. There we go. There's my first set of petals in. And I like it because it's variegated and it looks kind of I like it, yeah, and I get the idea of why you alternate now. Did you wonder? So, yeah, because then it actually like forms like, you know, the, the, the petals. So you're just doing it all one colour. Oh, sorry, not, not alternating the colours. It would it would still look nice, but it wouldn't give that effect as a flower. No, probably not. Yeah. It would all work, it'd all work yeah. out in the wash. Okay, so I'm going to my second, my Third, it's actually in my third row, and I'm going to put petals in the non-shared holes, which means just the ones that are already there, not the ones I'm adding tie wraps to. Does that make sense? Non-shared <coughs> holes. Yes, it does make sense. Oh. Yes, to all the wreaths I wear, to me, I don't know what you're on about. But I'm sure I shall get there one day. I'm going to double them up on the second row as well. Let's go in. Place it down. Snug it up. you got to make sure that this is quite snug. <coughs> so it, uh, so it stays. Alright. Then you just take this, start wrapping it around here. And if it doesn't come right to the other side, you just make it work, right? With clips, those yeah. are your best friends. Just come around. And where I come to this, this part here, I always put my next petal in, <coughs> which is directly across. Morning, Dottie. Okay. Happy Mother's Day. So there's where I placed it, and I'm going to put my next one over here, which is across. And that's just the way that I do it. You don't have to do it my way. Just whatever is easier for you. Yeah. It just makes it easier. But I'm still going to go with the blue to this side. So place it down. Excuse me. Zip tie it. Close. I just take it. Come around. Just like this. And here, I can attach it to this one. Yeah. Right? this, come around, 
but there's nowhere to attach it. So I'm just going to clip it. Just like that. <coughs> okay, so they're directly across from each other. We're pretty close. So I'm going to go to this side. <coughs> What's the difference between the silver flower in the rose? This is from Kerry. Good morning, Kerry. Good morning. Um, this the Sarah flower is going to have different petals on the outside. You'll see in a minute. I'll show you. So now I'm going to put blue to the inside because this is. So just place it down. <clears throat> and we're going to put eight on these non shared holes. Hi, Debbie from the capital, Ottawa. Ottawa. It's in the house. So next week I have uh, my first craft show in forever. Where are you going? It's here. Oh. It's at the Agriplex. So it's usually on Good Friday. They always have the same craft show on Good Friday. But they were still using the Agriplex for vaccinations. Yeah. So they changed it. Come to this side. Yeah. So kind of nervous but well, I'm not nervous I'm just you're great you've done it before I know you but know the score I do but um, it's been two years since yeah since I've, like big shows big yeah. shows yeah so that, that is the big place and it's got I don't know how many how much room for vendors but I've done the one there's at the, like uh, um, Christmas show there yeah it's crazy it is. um hi Ida the Christmas one is like four days and it's insane. Yeah. But um, so if anybody uh, from my Facebook page come to the craft show, just tell me you found my cat and you'll be, uh, you'll get a special treat. I found your cat. Yeah. So you just take this and clip it down. Coming together here, people. Yeah. Taking shape. It's taking shape. So you just come around and clip these together. And this is really tight, and I know it is. But that's the way I like to do my um, my uh, flowers, my roses. I like them really compact. That's just me. Once again, it's you just add one to the wrong. People can make them and not tight. Yeah. Yeah. Absolutely. So let's go this one and we'll go with the dark. Good morning, Nancy. Happy Mother's Day to you as well, love. My son called me or texted me this morning and wished me a happy Mother's Day. I'm going after the market to his house. He's going to. Have a barbecue for his mama. Which is great. Hi Emily. Okay, we're doing so good here. It is, it's coming coming along nice. Yeah. I like it. Yeah, I do too. So we'll just come to this one. I'll I'll try and make one eventually. <laughs> Might not turn it like that, but I'll oh, have to give it a go. Tony, I tell you, I, uh, Anthony, I, it's, it's my nemesis. Yeah. I'd rather do almost anything else than do a rose. And some people I know can just whip them up in no time. Yeah, like so, certain these people can do a lot quicker than Yeah. Than others. Um, not so much me. Ooh. Okay, so you got a lot of root stuff going on here. That's all right, that's what you want. Okay, I'll show you in a minute, guys, what we're at, how we're at here. Just gonna place Oh, things. last night, Carrie, my daughter's in Italy, so she waits, yeah. She waits until 2 30 in the morning. Aww. She can call her mum. That's awesome. Yes. All right. All right, so I think we should be good. Put that. And we're good 
there. Get there. Get there. Cut that off. Get there. Get there. A special shout out to Charlotte, Maggie, Ann, Jack, and Thomas. Uh, for their mum, we've sadly passed away, but she's with you in spirit today. Yeah. My mum's been gone quite a few years too. Okay, guys. So here's where we're at. I love it. It's nice, eh? Yeah. Okay. I always wondered seeing them, how you've actually made those. Well, now you know, my friend. Now I know. No, I'll... Yes. I so... I trade secrets. <laughs> I got another rubber band. <clears throat> <laughs> in my pocket and what I do is just come around and rubber band this and that just keeps them all tidy okay. and then I can take these off okay and that's where we're at people Gotta be dental taking these off. There we are. So there's my rose center. I'm gonna put more stuff in there, but not right now. All right. Okay. So the next thing we're gonna do is make the petal for the outside. Now, I've already made most of them. I'm gonna show you how to do the hole. better assistant then. No. Oh, I have a pretty good assistant. Okay. So I'm using poly burlap to make the outside petals. But they're the same sort of color almost. Um, anyway, so it's just 10 by 10. I wood burn it and I'm just going to make a Dean Michael fold. Dean Michael fold is the type of petal. Why is it called a Dean Michael fold, do you think? Oh, let me think. Maybe the... Is it a guy? It's a woman. Well, I Sounds like a guy to me. Well, she invented, she obviously invented the power. There we are. Okay, so just take your bottom to the top, and I like to have the finished edge on the left. That's just me. You can have it on the right. I like it on the left. Nice clip. And I go halfway down, and this is just me. You don't have to do that. But that kind of keeps these trained to be in one spot. Come into the center and make a pleat. And then make one more and one more here and one here and one here and then just take a little rubber band good morning john happy mother's day to you as well sweetheart these are crappy rubber bands so. all right so i go about an inch up okay now what i like to do is just clip this off here I don't want any excess. Thank you. So there's my petal. And I'm going to put 16 of them on the outside. I'm just going to put these up here. Have a drink of coffee. The most important thing of the day. And I've got some more of these. I'll, keep, I'll show you another time. And then I just take this, and I'm going to go to the outside petals now. So the outside row. Doesn't matter where you start, keep both anywhere you want. I like to keep everything in check. So once that's down, flip it off. Probably wait till all of them are in before I clip them off, and you could just take this off. Yeah. But I go in the same direction. Come around this way so that all the finished edges are on the same, are following the same direction. And I've already gone ahead and made these just for time. Just place it down. See how it's just touching it, and snug it up. What do you think, guys? I think it's going to be pretty. Yeah, I do. 
miss the beginning. Okay, well, okay. Jan, that's okay. Catch you later. Catch you later. Just the uh, center bros part. Now just go around and put all these in. So you're gonna need 16 of them. <laughs> 16. So what's that? What's that with 16? Oh. Mom, I don't know. Who I, I don't know. I think, um, I wish I was 16 and know what I know now. Oh, God, yeah. I'll be a multi billionaire. Oh, yeah. I would, too. I'm kind of glad that fashion isn't the same as it was when I was 16. Oh, well, yeah, but... A lot of the 70s fashion has come back now. Yeah. 70s. I like to call those that, uh, my hallucinogenic years. Peace, baby. Peace out. Yeah. Okay, keep going. This is going to be so pretty. And the thing is, is you don't want to manhandle these petals because the more you play with these, the, the more it frays. Because this is like poly burlap. And it doesn't matter what you do, you're going to have fray. Just, that's the way it works. Yeah. And to what day, you wouldn't think it would, I didn't think it would fray that much when I just did my, my the flower, the Ukrainian flower the other week. Yeah. But it does, uh, um, I noticed how easy it is to spray, but at first I thought, oh, these are quite durable. Well, they are durable, but like you said, they fray easier. They, you, yeah. you, you caught a bit on your sleeve, didn't you? Yeah, I did. Come around. Put these in. 16 on the outside. Pop says the beautiful shades of blue. Yes. Nice blue. It's pretty. It's just me. I like it. Here we go around. So I've got my hanger on here and this will cover it, which is what down. Careful, careful with them pliers. <laughs> All right. Right, Terry. I smacked my pulling these up. <clears throat> I I lost grip of it. Smacked me right in the face. No, it did. I smelled it. Kind of like a little abrasion on my nose. Two. Two story. A little abrasion. A little abrasion. Yeah. That's the nurse and me talking about yeah. that. Yeah. Okay. It's pretty. All right, one more. Going in. And then what do you think we're going to do? Tony, Anthony? Um, I don't really know how you're going to carry on with the... Yes. We're going to trim. Just cut them off. And then after we cut them off, what do we do? Turn them around. Oh my goodness, he got it. about it. All right, now, I'm just going to put this up here for a second. The second one I'm going to use is like a light blue. It kind of goes with this. I do, Pat. I have the best teacher. Same color, but I got it in poly burlap. 
and I got them, I think, I got this from, um, Unique in the Creek. Unique in the Creek, I think, is where I got it all. And you can get everything there, my friends. You can get your zip tie. You can get your, um, plastic bags. No, you can't get them there. Although, I don't know if I've never really, I just go to the dollar store in the hair section and you can get like 500 for a dollar 25 which is good just take your little rubber band and i'll do one more and you're going to need whoops um eight of these ones this color in the middle, little pleats. <laughs> I know. Thanks, guys. Okay. Do you want to cut those ends off for me? Here? Certainly, dear. Thank you. All right. So I'm going to place those in the second row. There's only eight. I've already got them done here. Well, Anthony uh, do some trimming. does his trimming. Place them down. Just like so. Put them in. What's our time there, Tony? Anthony? 25 to 10 dollars. Oh my goodness. Oh, those should be good. <clears throat> With time to spare, just place these in. Like this. And they're widely spread apart and that's what you want. This is just an accent color. You think, guys? You like it? It's coming along nice, yeah. Give me thumbs up. Let's see. Let's see them thumbs up if you guys are liking that. All right, one more. There we go. Thank you, thank you, thank you. All right. Alright. Thank you, Debbie. Debbie loved it. Awesome. Cut these off. And I know I do things sometimes that are a little bit uh, unconventional, but do, you know, it's just about making it your own. So just go ahead and make it the way that you want. Just like that. Thank you, Kathy. Happy Mother's Day. Here we are. Just turn these to the side so they're not poking up. Now I'm going to go to the third row with dark, the darker of the blue. And this is where it can get a little challenging. So you want to kind of just stuff it underneath there. That makes sense? And you're it using the, yeah. the holes, the shared holes. Okay. Oh, I threw my stuff on the ground. That's awesome. Okay. So you just take this and you just stuff it in and try to go underneath. And you just snug it up. Snug it up. How many shares of blue are in the room? Two. Two shares. Just light and uh, dark. Okay, and I'll hold this up so you can see. Turn your side thing to the side. So here's what we got. See how it's tucked it down into here, right? So you can't really see it. Yeah. Well, you can, but you can. So I'm going to open this up, and then it'll be beautiful. Take your next one. Come in. Are you going to make a flower? 
It's a small or a long board. It's a small okay. board. You can use a, a large board. I didn't have a large board, so that's why I'm using a small board. Just open up your paddle slightly. Place them down. And this is going in the shared holes. Okay. I'll go ahead and clip these off. These lossy buns are not doing it for me. Well, <clears throat> They, they're not as good as they used to be, I tell ya. Used to be so much better. The pergles. Yeah, I know. Just come around. Flip them off as you go. Just helps. How you making out? Uh, And you have a little bit of gap here, but you don't need to worry about it, right? We can fix the gap. The gap is not a big deal. guy's got a feminine side, so that's, that's what some guys don't really like now, they're just shy, you know. Yeah. 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 I agree. I don't care. <laughs> One more, and then I'll show you what it looks like. But remember, we've, we've got this all, like, bunched up. So once we let the, that down, Right, Sherry. Now, obviously, once she's done these petals, it's all coming together now. Okay, guys, I'm going to hold it up so you can see. So there's where we're at. Beautiful. Nice. Thank you, so, Melissa. It is. So, remember how I put that rubber band on here to hold this up? I'm going to actually just get some. Make sure you got your glue, right? And you put rubber band on here too. But pull that down. But I'm going to put extra in here, right? So just come down. And if these decide they want to peek out, that's okay. So just come down. So 
You've got these, and I'm just going to place them down just where it kind of you need to have a little bit of something, something. You need something, something. Yeah. Is that a technical term? Yeah, it is. Okay. So you just go around, place these down, and I'm going to, like, not right now, but I'm going to, after we're done, just glue all the little ends that want to come up. It's a tiny little dab. A tiny dab. And I'm kind of alternating with the blue. And the shiny blue. I call it the shiny The glittery blue. Just place them in. Just throwing everything everywhere. down. Place them in. You have to make a couple more. Make a couple more. I think I need a dark blue. Come in. There go. Let this come Hi, this Melissa. This way. You said it would look perfect in a dining room. In your dining room? Oh, okay. We'll make it. You can yes. get all this stuff from Unique in the Creek. Just order it. Yeah. It's all it's, of Unique. So there's a picture of it in your living room. Yeah, it'd be pretty. Some crop scissors. Crop. Do you have good scissors next door? Alrighty. Oh my goodness. Alright. There we go. Now I'm going to add a little more if I need to, but hit the gist. All right, so I'm gonna hold it up. Are you ready? Drum roll. Here we go. There is our Sarah flower. Beautiful. Thank you. Now I'll just Go around and kind of touch things up, add a little glue if I need to. But that's it. That's it for today. You guys have an amazing Mother's Day. Yes. So all the mothers out there, you do a fantastic job. Yes, we do. We love you all. Awesome. Happy Mother's Day. All right. Thanks for hanging out today. Thank you. It's been a I'll come again next week. Alright, I don't know what we're doing. We shall do something um, extraordinary again. It won't be anything you like over the top because you know I got the craft show on Saturday. So make sure you come to the craft show. It's at the London uh, Agroplex Western Fairgrounds. And um, hope to see you all guys there. Make sure you find my cat when you're there. A little special something. Anyways, until then, have a great day. Happy Mother's Day. Love you all. And we'll see you soon. Bye.